Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So a couple of days ago, I posted a video letting you know that Chrome's memory saver feature that's built into the performance um, section of the browser will soon let you select when your tabs become inactive. So this is a feature that's very similar to the sleeping tabs feature we get over in the Microsoft Edge web browser. And I went on, as many of you will know, um, Chrome frees up memory from inactive tabs. So when memory saver is on, it basically helps you to save system resources. Now, when I did post that video, I didn't actually have the feature available. But um, it is now available behind an experimental flag, which will actually enable uh, the 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 options now to be able to select when your tabs become inactive. So if you are following new features in uh, Google Chrome Canary, and that would be in the latest version, version 115, then it is impossible now to enable the feature using an experimental flag. So if we head up to the address bar, enter Chrome colon forward slash forward slash flags. Uh, in the search, we just paste the flag in, which is called enable the multi-state option for memory saver mode. The description reads, when enabled, memory saver can take one of three options. The first, enabled with a heuristic mode. The second, enabled with a fixed timer. And the third, disabled. Um, configure this through the settings page. So it places those options now on the settings page. Change that from default to enabled. Relaunch um, Chrome Canary version 115 to apply that flag. And now when we head back to the performance page, there we go. There's our options now to be able to select when our tabs become inactive very similar to the um, sleeping tabs feature over in Microsoft Edge as mentioned and we have options now to change this from five minutes right through to one day and uh, um, I'll actually leave the original video I posted down below in case that would be of interest but nonetheless I'm um, now behind an experimental flag so and once again, this is a good indication, and I actually think this will roll out to uh, the stable version in an up-and-coming release. Um, this is a good indication because it's behind that experimental flag and is now available to test that this will become a default feature one day in the browser. But obviously, as things change and more information becomes available, I will let you guys know and post accordingly. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.